right back in that same spot. Ooh. Ooh. Sloppy Joe. All right, you guys. So, uh, Lake St. Clair, 26 degrees this morning. Man, it's bitter cold, but um, <clears throat> got a few hours this morning to give it a shot. A uh, water temp here in the marina is 46. I'll update you on that at the fishing ground. The sun's just getting ready to peak over the horizon here. And uh, it's gonna warm up, but man, it's cold. I mean, I've got three sweatshirts on, jacket, you know, the whole nine. It is April 28th, 2022, and it's still winter, so. Cold. But I'm gonna get off here, put my gloves on, and uh, get motoring out to the fishing ground. So I'll see you guys out there. There she is. There she is. Hopefully gonna warm things up, man. It's been so cloudy, cold, snowy, miserable. That right there. There's a sign of relief, baby. Sun peeking up, look at that. Take it in. All right, let's go. All right, guys, so we're just getting started here. As you can see, I've got some good structure. I'm in about eight foot of water, eight and a half. Um, what I'm using, get away from the sun, what I'm using is these uh, Samurai Swimmers from Third Eye Fishing. They've got that little extra that little extra shaboing there. And, uh, you know, I don't know. I'm sure these fish have seen it, but I doubt it's as often as everything else that's getting thrown around here. So, it's a little bit bigger of a presentation. But, sometimes, big, hungry, lethargic fish want that if you know what I mean you guys it is clear like this water's crystal I'm talking crystal I haven't seen it this clean in a long time which means we're gonna have to be making some long casts Ooh, man, that feels like a good one. That's a toad. That's an absolute beast. There he is, guys. Take a look at that. An absolute beast at sunrise. Lake St. Clair nailed the crankbait, man. What a beauty. I'm gonna weigh him quick. Four or five. Beautiful. I mean a dandy. Let's get him back in. Water. Crystal clear.
him that time. He came back for it. Not sure how well I got him hooked. He hit it once and then... Oh yeah. seen the boat and spooked. smaller swim bait presentation. This is the Saucy Swimmer by Guggen Squad. Second cast. Beautiful smallie. Not a tank, but good fish. Let's get him back. I mean, really? Stay hooked up. He's gonna... oh, that's a good one. Alright. There he is, guy. Straight. Pegged it. Not quite top dead center. But I'm using them uh, third eye fishing. Samurai. Right there. First time throwing them was today and uh, really starting to pay off. And by four other boats, I mean, that's not a lot of other people. Back in that same spot. Ooh. Ooh. Sloppy Joe. Ooh. Oh my. Quick, 
I'm guessing. Probably, probably three, three and a half, maybe. Yeah, three and a half. Beauty. Andy, let's get him back. Later, dude. They're in here. My drag was loose. <laughs> Set the hook. Unless it's a big old sloppy Joe. Oh yeah. Got him. Another one, guys. Not a tank, but on that uh, samurai swimmer. Such an awesome time. Proof catch and release works because he's been caught. Check him out. Get that out of there. I've got really bad things in my hands. <laughs> he's mad. Let's get him in. He drilled it. Hey guys. Oh, spit the hook. I swapped over to the, uh, ooh, fist. Swapped over to the uh, Guggen squad. Bait. Right there. Nice one. Two pounder. 